without it actually confirming. That's the okay. same setting I showed you before. And under automatically send messages, we can send those automatically. That will affect CarPlay as well. Not a huge update there, but something that's different. And also if we go back home, go into podcasts, we now have a library option. So podcasts gets a library just to make it a little easier to use on a CarPlay device. Also, you can now hear the new Siri okay, sound. So okay, let me turn my microphone so you can hear that. Also, fueling and driving task apps will be supported in CarPlay now. So according to Apple, they'll be available in CarPlay so you can use your favorite one to fill your tank and provide you with road information, toll support, towing help, and more. So expect those to roll out as iOS 16 is updated on more apps. So app developers will need to update it on their end. The weather app gets a little bit of an update and weather, you can see the widget itself is telling that there's drizzle. It will also give us information as far as warnings and weather advisories on our lock screen. So you can see the widget there matching the one on the oh, home yeah. screen. And then at the top, if maybe there's a storm coming in, we'll get information about that here. Also, if we go into the weather app, we can see different forecasts. So you'll see cloudy conditions expected around 9 p.m. Scroll down. We can see different forecasts. If we tap on the overall forecast here, we can see what it's like altogether what we're expecting as far as weather and more so we have much more detailed models go in here and you can see things such as uv index wind rainfall feels like humidity visibility and pressure we also have hourly forecasts for the next 10 days so as you can see that here we can see hour to hour what to expect if we go back out there's different hourly forecasts so it's really nice this update i've been using it for a while and i really appreciate the weather updates and like i said if you set your lock screen it will actually match and start raining so let me show you that quickly so here's the new weather wallpaper you'll see it's raining on the lock screen and if i go back to the home screen it shows that as well so it's not animated in the background it just gives an update of what it looks like but if we go back to the lock screen it can the screen itself and then it stops contacts get some pretty major updates if we go into contacts this will be very welcome for people who want to create new lists there's a new list view you can add a list to iCloud or iPhone and also within these lists you can also find duplicates if you have duplicates it will show a separate option here if you don't that disappears the same is true with photos if you have duplicates it shows up if not it disappears if we press and hold on one of those lists, okay. we have the option to email all, message all, okay. and we can finally ah. easily export uh, our contacts, rename them, or so delete guys, them. Lang, guys, yung also, if we get into maybe our favorites, eh, if we use two fingers and then just drag lang, down, we have the option to so select them very quickly. This is similar to what you can do now. If we press and hold here, so, we have the option to copy share. Niya. We can merge those duplicates, oh, remove okay them from the list, and then we have the option to select them. So, so thank you for watching and I may not and then also if you just want to simply share tutorial. these so multiple feeding you can no and, and then just copy these to a different uh, app paper and, and share those